some years ago. I was working as an international secretary in the Middle East. What were you doing out in the Middle East? I had many different lives, Alistair, in many different countries. Oh. But I fell in love with an Iranian, so... Oh, did you? And, and lived as an Iranian wife. You didn't marry? No. Okay. We weren't allowed to. Really? His family was Jewish, and I wasn't. When you're in your 20s, you're so idealistic, and you'll do anything for love. Only the close family knew that we weren't married. It was against the law. But the neighbours, we had to say that we were married. Shoharam, my husband. Would you have married him if you were allowed to have married him? After the revolution started and when they shot up the British embassy, he came to London and we lived in London for about six months and he had to go back and then it was the Iran-Iraq war. And knowing how unstable everything was, um, I took the decision to, to stay in London. Broke his heart. So, broke my heart. It took me decades to get over it. I've been creating this facade for everybody else. But inside, you're dead and dying and cracked. So what are you looking for now, then? Somebody to share my life. Share some of the things I do. Yeah, me too. I, I do want to be in love. You know, it's, it's the most, the best thing ever, isn't it? Yes, it's been a long time.